New PNP Chief Guillermo Eleazar says one of his marching orders as new head of police is the implementation of an intensified cleanliness policy in all police stations. Let's get more details from Patricia Mangune. She is reporting live from Camp Krame in Quezon City. Pat, good morning. What do you have for us? Charles PNP Chief General Guillermo Eleazar did again emphasize that he will be implementing his intensified cleanliness policy as his marching orders for the entire PNP. But Eleazar said he will not change the existing rules within the organization, but only enhance it with his intensified cleanliness program. This focuses on cleanliness in the office, in their ranks, and in the community. So Eliazar noted he may possibly conduct a surprise random inspection to check if police stations are kept tidy. He also expects station commanders to do the same. He also said that he trusts the Internal Affairs Service will continue resolving administrative cases against erring cops. He targets to get rid of the Palakasan or Padrino system, starting from the recruitment of police applicants to make sure all get an equal chance. He also said the same goes for his program for all police to initiate quicker response to complaints without needing any referral or intervention from a senior officer. To keep the community clean, the PNP will continue their law enforcement operations. And for transparency, Eliazar said the goal is to have the 2,700 units of body cams fully utilized once all protocols have been finalized. Charles, meanwhile, Eliazar also reiterated his order to arrest any uh, quarantine or health protocol violators or those not wearing a face mask. As long as local police will make sure to place them in a spacious holding area, not more than 12 hours, provide them with a face mask if needed, and should only penalize them according to the local ordinance. Charles? Thanks for that, Patricia. That was Patricia Mangune reporting live from Camp Kramer.